literally can't believe what happened this morning. I was expecting maybe one squirrel, but there were five. I walked out the house and I saw one almost immediately and I've been sat here for almost two hours and it's almost been constant red squirrels. Of course all the birds are there as well, but I can't believe that the red squirrels are actually in my garden. Last winter I hardly saw squirrels and they never came to the ground. I've also noticed that there are hardly any pine cones in the trees or even on the ground. So that's probably the reason they're coming to the ground is because there's just not a lot of wild food. So they have to get some extra food, but that's fine with me. Okay, I'm cold, time for a coffee and a shower. I want to make a Christmas wreath for our front door and I've already made a metal ring out of some old chicken wire from a fence and now I'm going to cut some branches and I'm gonna weave them through the, the chicken wire and make a wreath. to say a quick thank you to the sponsor of this video, Squarespace. I'm really grateful that Squarespace have been supporting me so much this year and I'm really excited to create a new blog on my website. It was really easy to set up and I've already included photos from this video of the squirrels in the snow in a new blog and my plan is after each video I'm going to put my photos on my blog and you can preview them on a big screen. If you want to give Squarespace a go, head to squarespace.com slash dannyconnorwild and you can save 10% off a new website or a domain using the code dannyconnorwild. Today is my first day back in Sweden and I'm in the squirrel forest and it is just beautiful. There is so much snow. The forest is really quiet. I haven't seen any birds. There are no squirrel tracks. I've seen um, that some roe deer have been sleeping in this forest so maybe I can do a bit of camera trapping here but it is so nice to be back. It is minus 25 right now and I feel good. Um, I've got these heaters for my feet, so my feet are warm. Well, not warm, but comfortable at least. Oh, it's so nice to be back here. I had the most amazing morning. I woke up like an hour before sunrise and I got ready, got on my thermals and I stepped out of the house with my camera and I look at the tree where the squirrels usually come down and there was a squirrel. I spent like two hours photographing five squirrels and yeah, you, you would have seen but I was just so happy and honestly, the reason the squirrels were there was because our neighbour, who was actually 
just supposed to care for the house has been feeding the squirrels almost every day since I've left. So a ginormous thank you to Fred because I think it's going to be a very successful time back in Sweden. I'm going to get loads of footage and photos of the squirrels and that's all thanks to Fred. What happens in this forest, I don't know. There's no birds, there's no squirrels, there's no squirrel tracks. And I'm hoping when I start feeding, the birds will find the food first and then the birds will let the squirrels know that there's food here. I can see that there are squirrel tracks into the forest, so they are leaving the forest to go into the village to feed. So they're here, but they're just not coming onto the ground in the forest. It's just so, so pretty. <sighs> Since it's Christmas, I've come to the forest to find and decorate a tree. Last year we cut a tree, but I felt a bit bad, so this year I'm just going to decorate one in the wild. I'd like to have a tree that we have like in a pot in our garden and we can just bring it in the house, but for now I'm just going to decorate one in the wild and then bring back the decorations. <laughs> Okay, so I've found the tree and uh, there's so much snow, so we'll see how this goes. Do it. It is so lovely to be back in Sweden and I really hope you've enjoyed this video. Have a lovely Christmas and 
I might get a new video out before the new year, but if not, happy new year and thank you for supporting my channel. I'm really excited to continue making videos next year about wildlife. So have a great Christmas and thank you for watching. Bye.